What's up, Patriots? Welcome back to the Trash Talk Podcast. I'm Amari. I'm Isaac. And we're here with uh, a few of our friends. And we're just going to be talking about uh, what's happened over the last couple of weeks. So, how was homecoming for you guys? Yeah, uh, I had a great time at homecoming. You know, uh, it was my first and last homecoming uh, at this school, so I had a great time, you know? Yeah. I danced a lot. Oh, no, I, <laughs> I remember that for sure. No, it was yeah. very sweaty. Yeah. We were going crazy on yeah. the dance floor. <laughs> I Absolutely. was in the mosh pit, and I got pushed around a lot. Yeah, that, that, the mosh pit was crazy, I thought. I was like, I don't know, I didn't think it would be, especially with the water bottles and stuff, and the, yeah. like, to the point yes. where, like, stop the music. I thought I that had was to stop crazy. the music. Yeah, I got there. drenched. Yeah. I, thought, <laughs> I thought they weren't throwing enough water, honestly. Yeah. yeah. No, actually, you might be right, yeah. I could have had some more water. Yeah, I was thinking they, sorry, I, th- I thought I heard something. Okay. Um, the voices in my head. Yeah. <laughs> they just they've been ringing since homecoming. But speaking of ringing, I don't know. I thought th- I thought it was really loud actually. Like at the mosh pit, like I felt like my entire body like vibrating. I don't know. Oh, I haven't yeah. been in like yeah, a it was definitely absolutely. I haven't been in a concert scenario like that in a while, so I have. It's it crazy. crazy. Yeah. It felt great. Yeah. I don't dance, so I didn't I didn't go in there. <laughs> I don't know about that, Isaac. I don't know. I don't know. Didn't happen. Did not happen with anyone at all. No dancing involved that you can, night. You can deny it, but I know exactly what happened. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, I don't think I remember too. <laughs> yeah, homecoming is just. I, I thought the music was pretty good too. What do you think about the the music selection? Um, I kind of felt like for some of the songs, like you can definitely shovel to it. I don't know. I was dancing all over there. Oh, yeah, yeah, <laughs> dude. Uh, some of the song choices, it felt like I was back in like elementary school, like early 2010s or something like that. Yeah, I don't know. I thought I thought the DJ did a decent job of like mixing the two so that like people weren't like getting bored. Because mm-hmm. uh, I know that the the person I was at homecoming to, uh, they said that their homecoming, uh, that they had at their school was like really lame and that ours was like way more exciting and in general. I and she said it was a probably because of the DJ. So I would say because. In previous homecomings, it was in the gym, but now it's actually oh. outside. It felt way more lively because people were, like, walking around in the quad and everything. Yeah. I really like that it was outside. Yeah. There's also, like, more air circulation. Yeah, true, especially now because of <laughs> You're not COVID. struggling to yeah. breathe <laughs> yeah. in a hot room. Gentlemen, I don't know how you changed, but you did. That's mm. besides the point. I'm sure you guys have watched Squid Game. How do you feel about it? I liked it. I liked it a lot. I watched it in one night with my friends. Um, I enjoyed it, and I kind of stayed up out of school night. (laughs) (laughs) Like, I don't know. I get very emotional when I watch shows like that, and I'm like... Did you cry? Um, uh, spoiler warning, spoiler warning. We're going to put that here. Um, I mean, I felt... I didn't necessarily cry, but I definitely was, like, in the motion of doing so. Like, especially during, um... The marble game? Yep. That one especially, like yeah, I, yeah. I could not. I could. <sighs> that's messed up, man. I, and especially um, Ali, man. Uh, they did him dirty. Bro. Yeah, they did. What's his name? Sangwoo. Yeah, yeah Sangwoo. Bro, he did, did him dirty. dirty. Deserved it. What do you mean? Huh? Who? Ali? No, I didn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I say. Bro, what's wrong with you? I mean, I, I guess it's like a, I don't know, like the whole premise of the show is you do what you got to do, but then again, the person who won, like. Just like yeah. selfless most of the time. Now yeah, Sangu is like father. the most realistic character. Yeah, exactly. But like what he did mm-hmm. is pretty messed up. I don't know. Plot armor for Gihun. Like it's just uh I He's the one like he pushed I forgot who he pushed when he was they were doing the um It was the glass maker. Uh, oh yeah. yeah. The glass maker. He pushed the like, glass maker. I don't know. Like I mean they saw a time. To be honest, I'm well, I probably would have done the same. Final, so. Yeah. I mean, and then he killed, and then he killed the girl, dude. The girl. Oh, sixty-seven. Yeah, killed the girl that everybody is. What do you? Yeah. What are you guys' opinion on her? Yeah. <laughs> what do you guys feel about her? She's pretty attractive. Yeah, she's kind of cute. <laughs> <laughs> Good choice of words. Good choice of words. <laughs> Thank you, gentlemen. Yeah. What's another thing that happened recently? Oh yeah, uh, kick off the college. What would that feel like for you guys? I don't know. Kick off the college was just like, it. It wasn't really useful for me. Since I was, uh, I don't know, I was just talking with people all period for the whole day, and I wasn't really doing anything. 
Uh, yeah, I definitely feel like that as well. Um, I mean, it's definitely informative, but at the same time, I, th- I think they did it the wrong way, like as far as um, just having a bunch of students like in one room. Like, like which one did you do? Did you do like the UC Cal State or like the military thing? Yeah, they give me the Cal State one. And then I, really wanted, I originally wanted to do like community college, but for some reason maybe do Cosgate. It was like really unorganized, really. Mm-hmm. Just like, really just like switch it up and everything. Yeah. yeah. The so gift cards. Did any of you guys win? No, no. Nah. but I know someone who won. Yeah. yeah. Unfortunately, he can only buy two lemonades mm-hmm. at Chick Fil A. How much was the gift card? It was like five dollars. Of course it was. Mm-hmm. They have like Chipotle, and then they had Starbucks. I can only imagine that Starbucks was like the most useful one. Uh, as far as like, wait, how much did you say it was again? The what's it called? The, the Starbucks. The Starbucks? I don't. Oh. They didn't have. It was Chick Fil A. Oh. Ooh. No, they, they had it has three gift cards. Oh, three. I don't know. Yeah. Wait, which one were you in? Oh, I was in the Taco Bell one. That's not, I meant like Cal State. Oh. Or military. I knew what you meant. Yeah. Duh. Oh, yeah, we had an earthquake drill today. That one was, I don't know, the great shakeout or whatever. That wasn't even the great shakeout. No, no, no. Uh, how do you feel about earthquake drills? Uh, they're informative, but I don't get much out of them. It's more... Pure common sense at that point. Yeah. I, I feel like if you're in high school, then you should know what to do in an earthquake, <laughs> unless you're, like, a freshman. But then again, if you aren't taught in, like, elementary? They do the same thing in elementary schools. Well, but if you weren't taught, I'd imagine a bunch of high schoolers not knowing anything. They just run. I mean, they... Uh, even middle Elementary and middle school, you, like, you just... They no, they taught me. I, I'm pretty sure that's why it's common sense now. Yeah, exactly. Well, if they taught you, then it, it, they taught... Everybody else would also have earthquake drills. I don't know. Just feels like a waste of time. Especially if you're like us, because they're like tall, yeah. mm-hmm. and you're like sitting under the desk, and like you're just like my neck, I'm bending over, I'm in pain. And mm-hmm. yeah. I have to bend myself half and half. It's yeah, like, <laughs> yeah exactly. Yeah. It's pretty convenient for me. Yeah, mm-hmm. I can imagine. <laughs> so, speaking of the earthquake draws and Miss Max, when it happened. Oh, yeah, huh? Yeah, Miss, Ma- Miss Max is such a good teacher, bro. Like, she was also like sitting up, like, I don't know. To me, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't think like teachers like participated, and then she like actually like got under the table and like started like, <laughs> yeah, participating in it. Just, I don't know. I agree. She tries. Yeah. Yeah. Miss Mac is a great teacher. Yeah, we had her for uh, AP Chem. Chem. Oh yeah, Chem. AP Chem last year. I don't know how she does it, man. I had her for a sophomore year for chemistry. Mm. She oh. helped me a lot. Yeah. She was always like very caring. Like when I was like going through some like actual like real things, like she was like. Very understanding, like, very supportive of, like, me and my emotions, you know. Same here. Yeah. She's super down to earth, too. I mm-hmm. want to say that. She's real. Yeah, yeah right? Like, no BS. Mm-hmm. I don't know if I can say on the podcast. No, you can. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, like, no BS. She'll, like, tell you how it is. Like, mm-hmm. that's just a great teacher. Yeah. Like, overall. Never had her as a teacher for any class. But so I just know her from robotics, though. Mm-hmm. Get out. What do you mean? <laughs> I took the, what do you call it, the agriculture path. So I had a yeah. different chemistry teacher. So uh, sad. Yeah, you mean you missed like, out, man. Yeah. And I think my my sister had um, my sister <coughs> had Mac, and also my uh, my younger brother is going to have Mac when he comes back and he's a junior next year. My sister's going through chemistry, I believe, in this Max yeah. right now. And I've I've all I've all gave them the, gave them the warning, like you know, meanest teacher ever. So that's her thing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think that's all the time we have for today. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of the Trash Talk Podcast. I'm Amari. I'm Isaac. And thank you to our two friends here for being on the podcast with us. We wish it could have had uh, more of you guys. But, uh, yeah. See you guys later.